Side. Here I come again, right at you. Another week is facing, man, I'm telling you, it is wonderful. We're getting ready for Sunday. I hope you're getting ready for Sunday as well. It's going to be a fantastic day in the Lord. We're going to be talking about, once again, Jesus coming to seek and save that which was lost. Man, it's been a knockout series already, and uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just jazzed about it. Uh, so we got a big day Sunday. But before I tell you about it, let me rejoice in what happened last Sunday. Man, we had a uh, very special day. I want to welcome Gage Ashworth, Lily Slaughter, Andrew Word, Jocelyn Word, Emily Word, and Renee Daly, who all made decisions Sunday. Church, I'm telling you, God is on the move. And then, hey, how about Sunday night? baptizing 11 children. It was, I, I just don't know the words uh, to tell you how wonderful it was. Sunday night service was was incredible. And so I thank God for what he's doing uh, among us. So let's fast forward now to this Sunday. First of all, have I ever told you how to grow a light discovery? Well, first of all, you got to pray. You got to invite somebody. You got to show up yourself and you got to be friendly. So I'm really encouraging all of our members to get involved in life discovery and bring a friend with you. Can you imagine what it would be like? What, let's just picture it for a minute. One Sunday, everybody comes, everybody brings a guest. Oh my goodness, it would be a knockout day, wouldn't it? <clears throat> so let's do it this Sunday. Let's all invite somebody, get them in here. Let's uh, get them in life discovery and uh, let them be a part of the worship service. And it's going to be a great day, y'all. And then Sunday night, guess what we're doing again, church? Yep, you're right. The baptismal pool is already filled up. We're doing another baptism this coming Sunday night. And I'm excited about that. So thank the Lord for what God is doing. So to, I want to encourage you just to continue to keep your focus on God Continue to trust him. Let's all devote our hearts to him, commit our ways to him, and he will direct our path. I want to encourage you, my friend. A lot of us are maybe going through tough times in our life or struggling or having a battle. Uh, God is there to help you. And I, I know that you know that. But we as a church, we're here to help you as well. And we want to encourage you. We want to be able to walk that journey with you. You've got a great church. You've got a great God. And you've got a great life. So I look forward to seeing you on Sunday. God bless you.